I think a funeral sparked the idea for this story. Uh, I grew up Catholic. I don't identify as Catholic anymore, but I still sometimes find myself in the Catholic Church for funerals and weddings. And uh, A few years ago, I found myself kneeling at a pew and feeling very disassociative. Uh, I have an anxiety disorder and depression. And I think it's, it's like a common symptom when you're, when you're burdened with those ailments to have thoughts like, uh, it's, it's so strange that I'm alive. Uh, and you know, it's like feeling very aware that you're a living, breathing organism. Uh, and also like, you know, that you're a speck in a vast cosmos and that one day you will die and that one day everyone you know will die and uh, that at some point, you know, Earth is going to get sucked into the sun or hit some space garbage and uh, it's very likely that all memory of human existence at all at some point will go away. Um, and here I am and you know I'm wearing clothes and I have hands and it's crushingly strange that I exist at all. Um, so I was experiencing those kinds of thoughts but in, in a Catholic church during a funeral uh, and when you feel very deeply aware of your existence while in a setting surrounded by paintings and statues of death and angels and, and while you're hearing uh, you know speeches about bodies and flesh and blood and it's just a very bizarre setting to be experiencing that sort of sensation so all that to say i think a funeral i think a funeral uh, sparked the idea for this story